What's going on, gang? Um, we're getting straight to the shits. Five things I'd love for men to normalize in 2023. Clothing. What I love about society now is that men can wear whatever they want to wear. It's becoming more widely accepted for men to wear anything whether you're straight, bi, pansexual, gay, doesn't matter, asexual, wear what you like to wear. I've seen a lot of dope cardigans and even dresses. I've seen guys wear dresses, killing it. I really would like for 2023 to be more broadened, broadened up with the clothing. I love it. We're bringing back a lot of styles, wearing girly colors, whatever the hell that is, the pinks, the yellows, pastel colors, the, the loose, the tight. I mean, just like continue to flourish in what pieces of clothing makes you feel like you. Sexual comfortability. Hey, um, there's a lot of guys walking around here that aren't necessarily aware of where they stand sexually. Um, not judging you, um, you know, feel free to do what you like or ignore it. That's up to you. But I'd like to see men become more comfortable in their skin. What are you really? What do you like? How do you feel for reals? Just let it be known. Let it out. Be you. What do you really like? What makes you feel good? I'm not going to judge you. On the other side of the spectrum a little bit, and that's okay. It's okay. Hone in on who you are. It's a bit daunting, it's a bit scary, I get it. But dude, if you do it, you won't regret it. I feel like men should be more open-minded. Just let go. Just let go of what you think you know. Because as you get older, that is gonna change. Broaden your horizons, try different things, try new things, try doing things in a more, you know, unroutinely way, try it. Live a little, live a little. It's okay. If you're not trying new things and you're not trying to explore um, different frontiers, dude, you're not living. That's just my honest opinion. I'm not here to judge, I'm here to budge. Dude, do it. You're human at the end of the day and you have feelings. You feel sad, you feel happy, you feel lonely, you feel comforted. Dude, be in tune with your feelings. It's okay. It's okay to be sad and cry. It's okay to cry. You're a man. You're a man. Men cry. Men feel bad. Men feel good. Be in tune with your feelings. It's okay to express them. Talk about them. You're not less of a man if you're a crier or sensitive. You're not less of a man. I hate the fact that men have to be raw, raw, tough dudes all the time. No, because when you continue to do stuff like that, you're just hoarding those feelings in and it comes out in a negative way. Let it out. It's okay. Express you. Be you. My fellas out there, become financially independent. Stop depending on women. Stop depending on other men. Be financially independent. Get out there and kill life. Kill your independency. You don't have to make a million dollars. You don't even have to make six figures, but whatever works for you, make it work. S strive, flourish, make money. Be able to do things for you. Be able to go, man, I wish I had this. There it is. I wish I had that. There it is. Be financially dependent, guys, on yourselves. Right, guys, that's just a quick five for me. Um, I'm hoping 2023 is, you know, a year for big changes, um, progress within our personal lives and our personal bubbles and our personal atmospheres. Make those atmospheres bigger. Be bold. Be bold to go home. Subscribe, like, share this video. You know how we do.